Ellsworth, Kansas, boasts a rich history intertwined with the Wild West and the fight for a better future. Here's a glimpse into its fascinating journey. Early days, 1850s to 1870s. Native American land, the land belonged to various indigenous tribes before European settlers arrived. Frontier Frontier, by the 1850s, settlers began arriving, attracted by the promise of fertile land. The town itself was founded in 1867 and named after Colonel Elmer Ellsworth, a Union soldier killed in the Civil War. Cattle drives, Ellsworth became a vital stop on the Chisholm Trail, a major route for cattle drives from Texas to railheads in the north. This brought economic growth but also a surge of lawlessness. Wild West and Lawmen, 1860s to 1880s. Enter Wild Bill Hickok, Ellsworth gained notoriety during this period. Wild Bill Hickok, a famous lawman, served as Ellsworth's marshal for a short time in 1867. However, he was shot and killed by a cattle drover in a dispute. This event cemented Ellsworth's reputation as a Wild West town. Law and Order Challenges the town wrestled with maintaining order amidst cattlemen, gamblers, and outlaws. Another famous lawman, Wyatt Earp, even spent some time in Ellsworth. Settling down and growth, 1880s to 1940s. Building a community, as Kansas matured, Ellsworth transitioned from a frontier town to a stable agricultural center. Schools, churches, and businesses flourished. The railroad arrives, the arrival of the railroad in 1872 further spurred growth, facilitating the transport of goods and people. Facing challenges, the Dust Bowl of the 1930s brought hardship, but Ellsworth persevered. Modern Ellsworth, 1940s present. A diverse economy, Ellsworth's economy diversified beyond agriculture.